Why, hello again. Fancy meeting you here. And in your tennis outfit, I see. You must have practice every day after school. Gross. Please not today. I don't want to talk about my music and would rather not get into any discussions with you. Ever. I see you have the same clothes on from yesterday too. I'm just yanking your chain. I thought blowing you a kiss would help to smooth things over from our last encounter. I was a bit forward with my opinion on the viola and your school choice. I'm sorry. How about we start over? My name is Fergus. It is nice to meet you. No. I have no interest in getting to know you. You still do not know how to say viola. How about I call you Fargus and tell you to go practice your trombone? Would you like that? Please, just leave me alone. But wait. I have news for you. I was talking to my trombone teacher about you at my private lesson after my chops were worn out. He told me to tell you to look into Curtis. I had never heard of this school before. I have a passion for making beautiful music, but my trombone teacher tells me I lack the talent. In fact he says I have very little talent. Perhaps you should audition at this Curtis school. He told me it is highly selective and I would never get in, but if I was a viola player and I practiced very hard I just might pull it off. So if I can do it, so can you. Viola. It's Viola Fergus. I have no interest in Curtis. I find that you are very insulting. Any violist needs to be highly skilled and talented to get into any of the top conservatories. Are you stupid? Your trombone teacher must have been making a viola joke by saying you could switch over and get into Curtis. I have heard all of the viola jokes. Good and bad. This one is not funny. Not one bit. Au contraire mon frère. He believes I have the personality and drive to make it as a violist. The same drive you seem to possess. No joking around here. I have never been so excited about a career change like this before. Maybe we could be at Curtis together. I would, of course, ask you if you might be interested in giving me a few pointers. The Dalton Concerto seems like a good piece, besides you already know it. Will you help me learn Dalton on the viola? It's Walton. And it's viola, not viola and you are perhaps the stupidest person I have ever met. Well. I am not sure I agree with you on that one, but my teacher did tell me that playing the viola does not require too many brain cells, so perhaps you are flattering me in my newly found path. You and I are very much alike it turns out. I do not think anyone would actually make fun of an instrument or the one who plays it. I am honored to be heading down the path of the viola player. And, to have you at my side at this Curtis school? could be a dream come true for two up-and-coming viola players from Manzano High School.